गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबॉडी स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू लक्षा अकाडमी टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट बॉटनी क्लासेस दिस इज क्लास वन दिस इज द फर्स्ट क्लास ऑफ बॉटनी फॉर कमिंग जूनियर्स सीमा फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉट इज बॉटनी बॉटनी इट इज अ ब्रांच ऑफ बायोलॉजी दट डील्स विद द स्टडी ऑफ प्लांट्स so it is a branch of biology that deals with the study of plants that is called botany and uh, theophrastus he is called as father of botany so father of botany theophrastus botany is a term derived from a term bowskin that means cattle feed so what the cattle will be eating is nothing but plants about that plants we are going to study in botany that is called a branch of biology that is nothing but dealing with the study of plants that is called botany and in this botany we are going to in first year syllabus we are going to discuss about uh, different topics uh, in which uh, i want to discuss about a topic called morphology first of all we are going to discuss about a topic called morphology so in the first year textbook morphology is the major topic one of the major topic which includes very important information about plant structures and functions so about functions we will discuss in physiology in the second year but whatever functions different structures of plants will be doing that we are going to discuss in morphology for example a plant will be having two parts like root system and shoot system what the roots will be doing what the stem will be doing in the stem how the branches are formed and in the stem how the leaves are formed how a leaf will be performing a important function like photosynthesis and how the leaf structure will be all these things will be discussed in botany among which in morphology we will discuss only structure of different organs of plant body so first of all what is morphology it is a branch of biology which deals with the study of structure of various parts of plant body so what is called plant morphology it is the study of so morphology is a branch of biology or branch of botany that deals with the study of structure of structure and organization of various parts of plant body various plants of plant body is called morphology so what are the different structures present in a plant uh, about that uh, structure and organization we are going to discuss in the topic called morphology so first of all what is morphology it is a branch of biology that deals with the structure of various parts of an organism in which plant morphology will be dealing with structure of various parts of plant body so if it is dealing with plant body parts that is called plant morphology and if it is dealing with animal body parts it will is uh, it will be coming under animal morphology so now in our first year textbook we are having a syllabus called morphology which is very important chapter one of the important chapters so about that morphology introduction we are going to discuss now so what is morphology it is a study of structure and organization of various parts of plant body see children again morphology is having two branches external morphology and internal morphology external morphology means study of external organization means uh, see if you if we discuss about external parts uh, that will be coming under external morphology and if we discuss about internal parts uh, that will be coming under internal morphology 
द स्टडी ऑफ एक्सटर्नल स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ प्लांट बॉडी स्टडी ऑफ एक्सटर्नल स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ प्लांट बॉडी इज कॉल्ड एक्सटर्नल मॉर्फोलॉजी एंड इफ इट इज डीलिंग विथ द स्टडी ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ इंटरनल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ प्लांट बॉडीज पार्ट इंटरनल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ प्लांट बॉडी पार्ट दट कम्स अंडर इंटरनल मॉर्फोलॉजी और प्लांट अनाटमी सो इफ इट इज डीलिंग विथ इंटरनल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ प्लांट बॉडी पार्ट देन दट विल बी कमिंग अंडर इंटरनल मॉर्फोलॉजी एंड एंड इफ इट इज डीलिंग विथ ओनली एक्सटर्नल स्ट्रक्चर दट कम्स अंडर एक्सटर्नल मॉर्फोलॉजी इंटरनल मॉर्फोलॉजी इज ऑल्सो नोन एज अनाटमी सो अनाटमी इज नथिंग बट स्टडी ऑफ इंटरनल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन मीन्स हाउ द सेल्स आर अरेज इन ए टिश्यू एंड हाउ टिश्यू इज फॉर्मड एंड हाउ हाउ मेनी टिश्यूज आर प्रेजेंट एंड हाउ दे आर ऑर्गेनाइज इन एन ऑर्गेन and all these things about cells tissues organs in an organism that will be discussed under anatomy and if it is dealing with plant anatomy that is a, a branch called plant anatomy so if it is dealing with plant internal parts that is known as plant anatomy so like that in morphology external morphology and internal morphology two branches are present coming to external morphology we will discuss in this uh, external morphology about uh, study of external structures of plant body see a plant body will be having important structures like a root and stem about that structures we will discuss in this chapter in external morphology chapter we will discuss about uh, a root system first uh, what is a root uh, how a root is formed and how many types of root systems are there and how a root will be developing and what are the different functions root will be performing and what are the different regions present in a root all these things are discussed under root topic in external morphology and after root we will discuss about stem and what are the different branches coming on on the stem and stem will be showing growth aerially and on these uh, stem branches will be formed on branches leaves are formed flowers fruits uh, all structures will be formed about all those structures we will discuss in external morphology coming to internal morphology if you go for internal morphology or anatomy we are going to discuss Discuss uh, internal parts means uh, how uh, cells uh, will be organizing into tissues. So in anatomy, plant anatomy, first we will discuss about uh, different types of tissues present. So after tissues, we will go for transfer sections of stem, root, and leaf. so if you take transverse sections a uh, stem uh, root and leaf how they will be showing uh, different parts all those things we will discuss under internal morphology i think you understand a branch of botany called morphology this is very important branch and it is very important topic uh, which will be covered in your first year under morphology we are having external morphology and internal morphology and under external morphology we will discuss important uh, topics like uh, root stem leaf inflorescence flower fruit seed all those things we will discuss under external morphology coming to internal morphology anatomy we will discuss about tissues different tissue systems and uh, different internal parts present in stem root and leaf all those things are covered under anatomy or internal morphology this is the introduction how a topic called morphology will be present in your first year topic uh, first year uh, textbook so this is about uh, morphology sira in your first year uh, textbook we also will be dealing with other branches like uh, cytology histology taxonomy embryology etc so what are uh, these branches we will discuss first cytology it is a study of cell so study of cell its structure its organization and different cell organelles present all these things comes under cytology study of cell it is also known as cell biology study of cell it is also known as cell biology and histology it is a study of tissues 
tissues a group of similar or dissimilar uh, cells which will be having a common function that is known as a tissue and that uh, study of tissues is nothing but histology coming to taxonomy taxonomy includes uh, this is nothing but a systematic position or systematics we also call taxonomy as systematics it is nothing but a branch of botany that deals with classification of plants so here in taxonomy we will identify a plant and we will classify a plant by taking some information from taxonomy characteristic taxonomic characteristics we can classify a plant about classification of plants we will discuss under taxonomy and under embryology we will discuss about formation of gametes fusion of gametes development of embryo etc all these topics will be coming under embryology so reproductive biology or reproductive means uh, here embryology includes reproduction and also development of embryo all these topics will be covered in your first year textbook only under embryology we will be discussing about reproduction in plants that to sexual reproduction how the plants will be undergoing sexual reproduction how the gametes are formed how the gametes are fused all those things we will discuss under embryology so these are the major chapters we will be covering in our first year textbook that is about morphology cytology histology anatomy histology and anatomy will be coming together anatomy is nothing but internal morphology that is also coming under internal morphology histology separate branch is deals with tissues this is also we we will be discussing under anatomy only coming to taxonomy and also embryology these are the different branches we will cover in the first year syllabus in your textbook we also will be covering other topics see this is the first chapter we will be seeing in the first year textbook in intermediate that is the living world so what is this world consists of living organisms and non living particles see what is the difference between living and non living things how we will define a living thing and a non living thing what are the different characteristic so present under living organisms all those things will be covered in the living world that is the chapter name is the living world this is the first chapter the living world so later in the second chapter we are going to discuss about biological classification biological classification this is your second chapter biological classification in biological classification we will discuss about different organisms different groups of organisms how they are classified and how they are kept under different kingdoms all those things we will discuss under biological classification how are living organisms are classified so in the first chapter we will uh, uh, identify a living organism and a non living organism in the second chapter we will classify all the living organisms into different groups uh, like uh, if you take uh, uh, biological classification includes both animals and plants first but in in our uh, botany textbook we will discuss about plants plants classification and the plants are classified into different groups like uh, different kingdoms like uh, five kingdoms like kingdom monera kingdom protista fungi kingdom plants and animals five kingdoms uh, we will discuss and under plant kingdom see what are the five kingdoms kingdom monera kingdom protista kingdom fungi kingdom plantae and kingdom animalia so these are the five kingdoms we will discuss under biological classification and among which we will go for kingdom plantae in the next chapter that is we will discuss about only plant kingdom in your next chapter that is the third chapter in your textbook is plant kingdom
so like this first we will identify living and non living organisms in the living world chapter and next we will go for other different uh, uh, living organisms classifications in biological classification and in third chapter we will discuss about plant kingdom means how a plant kingdom is classified what are the different uh, groups of uh, plants present in plant kingdom like uh, algae fungi bryophytes pteridophytes how they are present what is their body structure how they are identified all those things uh, we will be discussing in the chapter plant kingdom so these are the first three chapters coming in your first year textbook like uh, living world biological classification plant kingdom after that we will go for uh, already i discussed about morphology anatomy reproduction so morphology in morphology first we will discuss about uh, external morphology in external morphology we will discuss about uh, root stem leaf inflorescence flower fruit and seed topics so we will discuss under external morphology external morphology and uh, coming to internal morphology in internal morphology we will discuss that is anatomy i already told you anatomy so in anatomy we will discuss about the tissues and also internal structures i already told you in morphology after morphology we will go for anatomy before that we will discuss about uh, reproduction in plants see how a plant will be undergoing reproduction like uh, asexual reproduction and also sexual reproduction that all will be coming under embryology so after morphology we will go for embryology so uh, in between we are having anatomy and also cell biology so these are the different topics we will cover means uh, i am not at all discussing about entire textbook of first year but briefly i am giving you an idea in your first year textbook uh, we are going to discuss all these topics like uh, this all will be coming under first year syllabus so these are the different topics we will be covering in first year first we will discuss about the living world next biological classification next plant kingdom next morphology but uh, these three topics are somewhat uh, difficult in the sense uh, uh, more depth knowledge we need but morphology is very basic thing uh, that is uh, about a root stem leaf like that initially uh, we will be discussing about morphology such that the botany you will look uh, uh, it is very easy uh, later later stages if you go for a uh, tough topics also it is not that much difficult for you initially we will discuss about uh, i didn't mean that morphology is very easy but morphology is interesting topic that's why each and every botany lecturer in first year they will start with morphology so i also want to start with morphology and this is about introduction like that we will be discussing about different topics in your first year textbook so in next class we are going to start about morphology morphology means external morphology external morphology includes root stem leaf like that so first we will discuss about different uh, uh, parts of a plant body a plant body what are the different parts present root system and shoot system that we are going to discuss in the next class